good Ooh. good morning guys so ah, last night was great doesn't it just feel better when you're at like a good hotel you know what I mean <sighs> I need to go down the nerve of that guy putting us at the Roach Motel anyway so I just woke up I've been on this kick to where I just cannot sleep in. I cannot sleep in anymore so it's like 8 15 I'm about to get up and uh, well I'm about to get up of course I'm already up but I heard that they have breakfast there here so I want to check it out see if they do um see what it is just get like a little snack and then grab something for Jeremy as well and then um then I'll probably just go back in the room and chill I also have to ask them about a late checkout because the funeral doesn't start till 11 but um the funeral starts at 11 okay they may not have breakfast but um checkouts at 12 so I need to ask them about that so let me figure out where breakfast is and I will be right back Hi. I have a question for you. Do you want breakfast? We do not have breakfast right now. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Oh, the, with everything going on. Yeah. Also, one more thing. What about a late checkout? For today? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. What are you like? Okay, well, that was quick. <laughs> There's no breakfast, and I cannot do a late checkout. So, I guess back to the room I go. I'm going to have to figure out with Jeremy what I'm going to do now. <laughs> I think I'll probably have to leave with him and then just hang around Kansas City. I, oh my gosh. This is not good. <laughs> okay, y'all. I will get back with you once I figure out what's going on. It's a nice view. Good morning, guys. Actually, it's the same morning as the clip just before this. It's just a little later in the morning now. It's like 9.46, so I just got a dress, and I'll give you a quick outfit of the day. Um, Jeremy is in the shower. He's about to come out, get dressed. You know, he has to go to the funeral, and then we are going to look around Kansas City. Um, the only deal is, like, I kind of know the area we're in right now. I saw a lot of cool things over here. There's a mall and there's a couple other things. But the area that we're going to, like, where the funeral is, I don't really know where that is. So, I'm going to have to just kind of play it by ear see what happens. Um, what else? Thank God they had a coffee maker in the room, honey. So, I am just enjoying this good little coffee. Uh, we're gonna have to lug all this down i was trying to think about makeup like i kind of really don't want to put any on but then again like i don't want to just be out here looking scary either oh my gosh it is a beautiful day here but i can already tell it's hot okay guys so i am driving now we have just left the hotel i am i just dropped jeremy off for the funeral and if you can see, the funeral is at Christian Tabernacle Church of God in Christ, which we've actually been here before. Last time we were in Kansas City, I didn't even bring like funeral appropriate clothing because I didn't really plan on going to this funeral just because like these corona cases are just like going up, going up. So I was like, well, why I'm waiting? Since, you know, basically the hotel kicked me out. They were like, no, no leg checkout. <laughs> yeah, somebody just came in this funeral with a full set of rollers in. Like, I kid you not. I can't show her right now because she's kind of looking at me, but. The pink sponge rollers. Who does this? Why? Sis, if you don't have time to unroll your hair, you have bigger problems in life. You, you can't go to a funeral with your hair rolled up. And got the nerve to have on a mask too. Y'all, I, I wish I could make some of this stuff up. I just, I don't know. Oh my gosh, you guys. So I was driving to get coffee. And listen, I just had to pull all the way over. Do y'all know what I just freaking saw? I just freaking saw a freaking Captain D's. Captain D's, sis? 
We haven't had Captain D's in Oklahoma in about maybe 10 years, 15 years. It's been a long time. This just brings back such good memories. Uh, can I have just one moment? Thank you. So, I'm gonna talk low so she don't think I'm talking to her, but we haven't had Captain D's in forever, you guys. So, at first I was like, no, I'm gonna get my coffee and all that, but yo, well, it's it's like vacation, so why, if I want Captain D's, I'm about to get Captain D's, even though it's only 10.45 in the morning. So, just got parked, so the area that I was in before, I really didn't like, so I found another area about seven miles away, and it is absolutely gorgeous. From Captain D's, I got some shrimp here. And this is just their little butterfly shrimp. A piece of fish. That's for some ketchup, but I forgot. Let's give this a taste, y'all. I can't really taste the shrimp for tasting all the cocktail sauce. Okay, guys, so I've just been hanging out not doing much and of course i ended up at dollar tree so we're going to check out their dollar tree and see what they have come on let's check it out so you guys i saw the coolest diy for a flower wall and i'm really 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 thinking about doing it in like shades of pink i think I think that would be pretty. I'm trying to really decide if I want to do it before I start buying because I believe it took like <laughs> almost like 80 um, things of those. And you know, that's an investment. But to buy a flower wall is even more expensive. Look at these little cotton things they have. This is so cute. That's really cute. I'm also seeing a ton of fall stuff in here. Fall flowers. You see right here. Is it already time for fall? Look at this. Welcome fall. Cute little wings. These are really cute. I feel like you can do something else with this. I don't know what, but these are really cute. I'm also seeing a lot of the feather bows. I saw a DIY project where you could just take Dollar Tree house shoes and glue these on it, and it was really cute. My cats would love this. <laughs> they would love this. Got some pom-poms for all the little cheerleaders out there. That's really cute too. Super cute. Actually, I may get a pack of these for my niece. It'll be part of her Christmas gift that has, look at this. They got the little aluminum knitting needles. They got plastic. They got the plastic crochet hooks. What? I promise you Dollar Tree is stepping it up. Look, a little sewing thread kit. That's cool. light bulbs in your house for like these kind of globes they have these here for a dollar a dollar 2500 hours indoor bulb this is a great deal because you already know this is way more than a dollar that's a good deal we needed some of these when we cut the yard so i'm gonna grab this
So on top of everything else going on, we try to get to Ikea. Ikea is packed. Like when I tell you this line is around the freaking building right now. My attitude is quite shitty right now. He's texting me to come. What's up guys? So of course I had to come to end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, it's the next morning and that's why my hair is just completely over my head right now. <laughs> so I went to bed. Um, basically we tried to go to Jack Stotts, which was the last place you saw us at. They told us it was like a four hour wait. Like everything was just closed or crazy wait time. So we just came home. So anyway, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to hit that like button. Definitely hit that subscribe button. My goal is to get to 650 subscribers by the end of August. And I need your help to do it. And I will just see you guys in the next video. Bye, friends.